Hey guys, it's Jamie Benizri. We're at Legalogic headquarters with Mark Balkar. I love your shirt this week, buddy. Thank you, I'm trying to keep up with you. Mark, um, I want people to know who, who the real Mark Balkar is. Uh, before he became a mortgage broker, you come with a lot of experience and uh, a lot of good, uh, good credentials. So tell us a little bit about what you were doing leading up to the time that you were in real estate. Um, quite a few things. Uh, I worked in the nonprofit sector, uh, worked in public policy, uh, international development, I taught, uh, then I got into public, private to healthcare, so I've kind of uh, seen business from, and the public policy sector from various uh, different facets. So one of the reasons why I love to work with you and why uh, LegalLogic loves to work with you is because uh, you're, 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 you're fast, you're efficient, you have creative solutions, and I wanna, I want, I wanna ask you three different questions about the kinds of clients that uh, you serve. So I wanna start, uh, with question number one, the residential uh, path or vertical. Tell me about um, and what kind of scenarios, you know, residents or people who have your residential um, homes would call upon for your services. Well, anyone obviously buying or refinancing for so the typical scenarios uh, um, here in Quebec about buying and selling homes, refinancing a home. Uh, a lot of what we do together is more of the creative stuff where folks get in trouble uh, and, uh, you know, God forbid you get ill, uh, something happens to the mortgage, uh, there might be a death in the family, so now you get in trouble with the bank. So kind of the, the other side of the mortgage world where you get a 60-day notice yeah. or you get in trouble with some debts uh, or the building falls apart, what do you do? Yeah, so, th th those are good questions. So um, that's kind of the way that I see your profile too with respect to residential stuff. Um, Question number two, the second vertical that you that you you like to um, play in is the commercial side. Absolutely. Tell me about what you do in a commercial setting that kind of sets you apart from from everyone else. Well, I mean, there's a lot of uh, there actually, believe it or not, there are a lot more uh, commercial lenders in Canada than there are uh, residential banks or institutions that exist. Um, so there's a lot more options uh, in terms of what I do. I love to uh, finance buildings that a lot of banks don't like anymore. Restaurants, mm. uh, mixed properties, uh, people with um, uh, you know, not AAA tenants in terms of uh, small strip malls. I love that because there's a lot of lenders that do exist that I can bring a lot of value to the table uh, to clients that, that, that need that. Or even construction. Yeah. Uh, folks have a lot of buildings that are not being properly utilized. They could be standing vacant. Um, and uh, I think that th there's a lot of potential there with the right plan in place yeah. to, to redevelop. So thirdly, I want to talk to you about um, startups, uh, whether it's tech or whether, whatever the sector, you often get involved in uh, business financing, equity financing. Tell us, tell us you know, very briefly about what you do in that sphere. Well, because of my background w from various different industries, I've really gotten into working with entrepreneurs uh, through commercial financing, but also I, I've had a lot of clients ask me that they need uh, financing for their business. And it could be traditional means through a bank, or yeah. they might say, Mark, you know, can you help me find an investor that wants to be actively or, or less actively involved? So I'll go out and try to match uh, an entrepreneur who has an existing business uh, or a product or service, or it could be someone that's just coming out of the gates that needs to kind of formulate a team around them to 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 get to market. So I'll 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 kind of advise as a, as basically a financing consultant in that capacity as well. Mark Balcar, thank you for being with me. Thank you. And uh, maybe you'll get me one of those shirts uh, next time next time we're on, on camera together. Absolutely, rock and roll. Thanks a lot. Logic TV, Mark Balcar, stay in touch. He's a great guy. If you like this video, don't forget to press on that little thumb, don't forget to comment below, share the page, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.